Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You guys are probably like, why am I filming an intro later in the day? Um, and it's because I did film an intro this morning before I um, ate breakfast. Just kind of explain to you guys like I'm doing now about the video of what I eat in a day. But while I was editing it, I just wasn't in love with it. So I'm just redoing it. So I wanted to kind of mention two YouTubers that I personally love watching. I have my notification bell for them turned on because I just love their videos and I love their content. They are small YouTubers, so they ha they both have under a thousand followers. You know, it would just be so selfish of me to not share with you guys, um, you know, small YouTubers that I love to watch. I am gonna um, list them down below, but the first YouTuber that I absolutely love, she is such a consistent um, poster. She posts. I believe every week her name is Fern F E R N um, I'm gonna link her um, YouTube channel down below in my description box from um, you know what I see since I've been following her for the past you know couple of months she is a certified personal trainer she is Thai um, and um, she is just all about like fitness she is pregnant right now um, so she isn't doing a lot of like workout videos but I you know was I was binge watching like her videos and she is she gives great information you know about getting fit losing weight the right exercises um, so please if you're interested in that please go check her out another person that I really like watching She's also again a small youtuber actually she's actually a very small youtuber um, her name is Christina Fast. Christina is on a weight loss journey and she does like different fasting techniques and she kind of explains to you what she does, um, how much weight, uh, weight she's lost. I have my notification bell on for her as well so um, I always watch her videos. Please go check them out. I love watching both of their content and I just think, you know, they deserve to just have people like you guys that follow me watch them too because their videos are really great. So again, I will list both both of them, Fern and Christina's YouTube link down below in my description box. Without further right. or ado, I am going to go ahead and show you guys what I eat in a day. Um, and if you are new, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment if you guys want to see more of what I eat in a day. All right, guys, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for supporting me, for watching my videos, for always being positive, for following me on Instagram. I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys when you are done watching my video. So to start off for breakfast, I'm going to make two eggs over medium. And I'm very simple, I just add salt, pepper, and garlic powder to my eggs. And then I'm gonna add two turkey sausage patties to my breakfast this morning. Um, and I believe for every two patties, there's only two grams of carbs. So I wasn't gonna do toast this morning, but I decided last minute that I wanted to make avocado toast. 
So as you guys can see, I used the Harvest Wheat Bread and I'm only gonna use one slice. Um, one slice only has 11 grams of carbs. So I only use four ingredients for my avocado toast. I only use salt, pepper, garlic powder, and lime. So this is my breakfast guys. I have two turkey sausage patties. I only decided to just eat one egg and then my avocado toast. And I can't forget the coffee. So it is now lunchtime, and since I had a really big breakfast, I'm not going to make a huge lunch for myself. I'm just going to make a smoothie. Um, I'm going to be using blueberries, strawberries, and kiwi. So this is a great alternative for chips and salsa or chips and cheese dip. Um, I just discovered this a couple months ago. It is the avocado salsa from Tostitos and I just pair it with my veggie straws. It is really good. It's a really great alternative um, and definitely healthier. I believe this avocado salsa only has one gram of carbs per tablespoon. So that is definitely a win. So it is dinner time and I'm going to be making the Thai chili salmon.
Now, I usually make my salmon in the oven for about 30 minutes at 350, but I decided to do it on the stove today and it was a terrible idea. As you guys can see, all of the olive oil is just splattering everywhere. Um, and when it comes to like the texture, the oven is definitely better. So if you're gonna make salmon, please put it in the oven. I will never do it on the stove ever again. It also left my copper pans um, sort of like burnt and dark. So it was really annoying when I had to um, clean it off. It was really hard to get off. So I'm gonna be eating my dirty cauliflower rice with the salmon and one mini cucumber. I did cut the salmon in half. Um, I didn't eat the whole thing just because it was a really big filet. I am gonna add sriracha sauce. I love the spice and guys, this is my dinner. I try to keep my meals as simple as possible. You guys are probably like, well, that's so easy. Yeah, it is. That's the goal. Low carb, very simple meals. So this is my dinner for tonight, guys. All right, guys, and that is what I ate today. Um, I so I have some really bad news so I was supposed to go back to work in the office um, next week and I was so excited to film my meal preps for you guys but my go back to office date got pushed back for like another six weeks which is fine but now I don't get to film my meal preps for you guys I was really excited to do that just so you guys can see like what I you know eat at work um but anyways thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already um give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below let me know what you think of this video so i will see you guys in my next video which will be really really soon see you guys